skill. Catch you ahead in the game. My name's Sarah, and I play football. She came out last year as a seventh grader. She said, Coach, I'm interested in kicking for your team. I went and took her out and let her try kicking a few extra points, and she kicked the first one, and it went through. After talking to the coach, he said, you know, Rondo, just because she's a girl doesn't mean that she can't do this. I remember the first game, and she made two field goals, and then you could hear the boys from the other team saying, wait a minute, that's a girl. Since I've been practicing a lot, I can get from the 22-yard line. Whenever I miss one, it makes me nervous, but I know that I have to not give up. A lot of people that come and watch me out there, they all support me, and they think that it's really cool that I'm a girl kicker. Sarah is a great football player. Sarah is an excellent athlete. Sarah is the best kicker that I know. Sarah is one of us. The other male teammates, they uh, they support her very much. Once they saw me kick, they accept me. The guys, they put her right on and she fits in well, just like another teammate. It's fun being on the football team because the feeling of kicking the ball through the goalposts makes me feel excited just knowing that it's going through. Also do cheerleading and soccer. So go from cheerleading to football to soccer practice. If there's a girl who wants to play football, she should. Even if the guys don't approve her at first, once they see what she can do, they'll accept her. Just because it's a male dominant sport doesn't mean that a girl can't do it. And Sarah has proven that. Get your head in the game on Disney Channel.